it is time for another episode of What I Wore This Week. In this video, I'm sharing some simple outfit ideas for summer. These are some really great go-to outfits, whether you're looking for something casual, maybe something for date night, cocktails with girls. I've got a good mix of outfits here, but of course you can always switch out any of the pieces for pieces that you already have. I'll share links to everything that I'm showing you guys today, but I always link to similar pieces for whatever's not available. So be sure to mix and mingle any of these outfit ideas with what you already have first, and then see how you can refresh your wardrobe or update things if you need to. But I'm really excited for this video. I have some really good outfits to share with you guys. And I wanted to keep it simple, you know, some really cute outfits, but really simple and easy to put together. And you guys will be able to pull them off, no problem. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. My name is Ashley Park. This is Park Avenue and I have tons of fashion content. So if that's what you're into, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell because I upload multiple times a week and I don't want you to miss anything. Before we jump into the video, I wanna say thank you a million times to you all for all the amazing, loving, supportive, just really great comments that you all left me in my last video sharing my one year anniversary and updating you guys on everything that's been going on. I appreciate you all so much. I just I just enjoyed reading every comment. And so I really appreciate it. Thank you guys. If you missed that video and you want to hear all about my one year as a full-time YouTuber, then I'll link that video for you guys in the cards and I'll also list it in the description box so you can check it out. Now let's jump into the first outfit. This shirt dresses is one of my favorites right now. I love the way this fits and I really love the quality of it. This is from Everlane and I shared this and some other pieces from Everlane. I'm going to actually show you another piece in this video that I styled up. Um, but if you want to check out the the video where I shared more Everlane pieces, then I'll link it for you guys. A really good one to watch if you're looking for some pieces to update your wardrobe. But I just love this dress. I love the way it fits. I love that it's a classic Oxford style shirt in a dress form. Really nice, really classic. You can wear this so many different ways. You can wear this open with a tank top and shorts. You can wear it closed like I'm showing you here. You can wear it with jeans underneath, maybe something a little bit more slouchy and then throw on a pair of heels. I mean, you can go crazy with this. I love this. This is gonna be so cute with boots. I can't wait to style it for you guys as we get closer to the fall but love this dress. You can cinch in the waist really tightly if you want to. I just overall a really great dress. And it also comes in black. Um, it hasn't been in stock. as At the time of me filming this video, it's not in stock. Hopefully it comes back in. If it does, I do encourage you guys to get it if you're like me and you do love to have you know, some really great pieces in black as well. Really good. And then what I did was styled it up with my Gucci platform sandals. Really easy. I mean, this outfit, was just like so simple, but it's very comfortable. It looks really cute and it's a classic. So you'll be able to wear this over and over again and not really have to worry about it at all. And for my handbag, I threw on my Loewe puzzle because I wanted something neutral. This is such a good outfit. If you work in an office and you want to throw something on, easy but looks really cute this is a great dress now if you're like me and you didn't really like to wear anything monogrammed or logoed into the office you can just swap out the shoes that i'm showing you guys for a pair of like flat sandals a pair of pumps a pair of heeled sandals anything that you already have that you feel more comfortable wearing into the office it's gonna work. That's why I really love this dress because it's so cute, it's very classic. It's perfect to go into the office with, but it's also perfect for your weekend wardrobe. So this can do a lot. This can definitely do double duty and I love pieces like that. Here is this next look, so comfortable. I was really comfortable with this outfit and I thought it was just so cute. I actually wore this to a birthday party. I was able to sit in it for some hours, you know, eat, talk, you know, laugh, have fun. I just really love this outfit. So the top that I'm wearing is a crop top from Everlane. I love this. I also have it in black and I really wanna pick it up in the other two colors that I saw that it comes in in this really beautiful like teal shade, really vibrant and then also in white. It's a merino blend, so this is the kind of top that I can also wear once it gets a little bit chilly. It's not very heavy, so it's not too hot for right now, but it's also gonna be really great to transition into the fall. So I really like this. This is gonna layer beautifully under blazers. This is gonna be really great under cardigans. Love it. So I would pick it up now if you wanted to get it because once this is gone, I've never seen it on the Everlane website, so I'm not sure if it's gonna come back. I really love this top. And then because this color is a really nice like golden, um, kind of like marigold shade, I thought it would pair really nicely with my Zara cargo pants. These are wide leg and I love these. So I actually had to get the waist taken in because it was way too big, but it's still a little bit too big for me. But honestly, I think it kind of lends to like the slouchy, oversized kind of vibe. So I'm gonna leave them for now, but I may consider getting them taken in even a little bit more. I didn't wanna take them in too much because I wanted them to be like, you know, loose and easy breezy. 
Um, but after wearing them and they loosened up and everything, and they kind of relaxed a lot more because they are linen, I thought maybe I should take them in a little bit more, but we'll see. But for now, I'm happy with them. They look really great. Um, I like the length on them. Now for me, I wasn't able to wear them with heels because they come a little bit short with heels, but with flats, they're perfect. I'm about 5'6", so if you're shorter than me, then you should be fine with these to wear them with heels. But if you're my height or taller, then I wouldn't really, I'm not sure how it's gonna look on you with heels. But I do love the way it looks with flats. And to be honest, on really hot summer days, a pair of flat sandals is just more realistic for me. And I know it's probably the same for a lot of you. So I decided to go with my Fendi flats. I love these sandals so much, you guys. I just am so obsessed with them. I've been wearing them constantly. <laughs> I've probably worn them, I've had them for a couple of weeks. And I think I've probably worn them four or five times already. Like I love them so much, they're so cute. And they go really perfectly with my gold Saint Laurent Lulu and I just decided to pair it with it. That's been my kind of a go-to combination for me. The gold bag with these gold sandals, so cute. And it goes with everything that I have. So that's why I've been reaching for it so much. And I just love this outfit. I love how comfortable it is. I love how cute it is. It's a fun look. I love the colors together. That yellow and that olive green pair so nicely. But the yellow is more like a muted yellow, even though a bright, vibrant yellow would still look really great. I do like that this is a muted tone throughout the outfit. Really cute, the gold really pops with it. I was a huge fan of this, very comfortable. Next up, I styled an all black look. This is so perfect because it's really hot out, but if you love cargos like me, this is a really great way to style them up. I just threw on this strapless top that I got from Lulu's. I really like anything smocked. It just fits really well, it holds you in, and it complements your curves. And I just love the way it looks on. And then I threw it on with these high-waisted cargos that I picked up from Banana Republic a while back. I linked to something similar because these are not available anymore, but I can always find a good pair of cargos, so hopefully I'll be able to find a nice classic pair to share with you guys. But I'm pretty sure a lot of you probably have a favorite pair of black pants that you love, a pair of cargos that you love, and you can definitely just go ahead and create this look with what you already have. But of course, I'll link to something similar for you guys. For my shoes, I went with my gold sandals here again, perfect for this look. And these sandals pair really nicely with my new Fendi bag. If you did miss that one year anniversary video, I shared this bag in that video, but this is a new buy for me. This bag is new to my collection. I love this. This is a Fendi piece from 2016. I love the pattern on here and gold, of course, like fits me perfectly. I just love it. I thought it was so much fun and I had not seen this before so when I looked up the collection I was really you know this is the that was the first time I had ever seen it so I was like oh my gosh this is really pretty and I would like one other piece from this collection but anyway I talked all about it in that previous video so make sure you check it out this outfit came together really nicely very easy I mean these pieces they're all black and then I have pops of gold so this is something you can definitely recreate and if you don't have gold pieces you can keep everything black but if you want to add some interest then I would go with you can do a white pair of sneakers if you want to keep it simple you can do maybe a pair of mules if you have the Gucci loafers that will go really great with this if you want to do a heel maybe something that's like a patent leather sandal that would add some nice uh, shine a, a different texture to the entire look so this is just really an easy base that I have here. So you can add the accessories and really play it up there. So if you wanna keep it simple with the outfit, you can definitely play it up with the accessories. That's basically what I did here. I mean, those gold accessories really make the entire outfit. Next up, I have another all black look, and I really love this one. This one is like so chic, very effortless, easy breezy. Now, the top that I'm wearing is a linen top from The Gap. I love these oversized linen tops. Just size up one or two sizes and it'll be oversized. Really cute, just easy to wear. And then I threw on my favorite pair of linen shorts from Banana Republic. I'll link to these shorts because they have a few sizes online, but if you have a Banana Republic in your area, I would just go ahead and just go to the store and see if you can find these because they're on a super sale. I was able to track down the yellow pair, which is gonna come to me in the mail, and I'll show you guys when they come, but I'm not gonna be able to link because I know they didn't, they didn't have my size when I checked, but I was just able to happen on them, like I called up and they had it, so I was able to get them sent to me. So you might be able to do that as well. But these are my favorite linen shorts. They come in yellow and they also come in a teal color and then also in a tan, so they're really nice. I wish I would have gotten all the colors, but I don't know why I was sleeping on it. But I was able to get it in yellow and I have it in black. But anyway, back to the outfit, because <laughs> girl, you're trailing off. This outfit is so easy to put together. Two black pieces again here, everything's linen. It looks like a set. And what I did was, 
The belt that I'm wearing is not even a belt. It's my back strap from my Pochette Matisse. Now this is one of those like bandolier straps from Louis Vuitton. They, they're sold separately. You have to buy them individually. They don't, they don't come with any of the bags. And that's what I did when I got this back strap. I got it specifically in mind to wear with my Pochette Matisse way back when I got it but I decided to throw it on here as a belt. In the past, I've also styled this bag strap as a belt over coats. I really like the way it looks. It's really pretty, it's easy to adjust, and all I did here was just put it on and I put the hooks to the back, and because I blouse my shirt, you can't even see the hooks in the back. So it looks really cute, really easy, and I really love um, just that monogram, the, the brown reverse monogram, I think it looks really good. And then on my feet, I have on a pair of black flip-flops. These are by Burberry, and they have a patent shine on them, so that adds another, you know, little bit of sheen to the outfit, a little bit of a different texture, but they're very, like, streamlined and simple they're not too thick or chunky and they don't really distract from the outfit so I just also threw on my pochette Matisse because I want to tie in that Louis Vuitton monogram and I really love this this is just looks so rich I just love how rich this outfit looks and not just because of the monogram the linen here is a really great fabric so if you don't have like Louis Vuitton monogram for instance it doesn't matter if you have some really great linen pieces then that's actually what's really making the look. And then you can just throw on a black belt or a brown belt and then have a really good look as well. So it doesn't have anything to do with the monogram, but the pieces that you're wearing actually matter. The fabric, linen is a really great expensive looking fabric. It's high quality. And if, you know, it flows really nicely and it hangs on the body beautifully. So that's what's the most important about this look is the fit and the fabric choices. But other than that, you can definitely mix and match your accessories because most of the time accessories that you already have you can just pop those on because this is a very simple outfit again here so I want to show you guys how you can really create really nice looks with accessories and a lot of times that's the most fun part of the outfit for me I just love being able to switch out my accessories bags belts and then of course I had to throw on a pair of oversized shades it just worked so well here it was perfect and I'm ready and I'm off for the day I love this look here is the last look that I want to show you guys, and I absolutely love this slip dress. This is from Express. I also have it in pink. I will link to some other slip dresses that I saw recently in pink and yellow, and then I also saw one um, in like a, a really deep blue, like a midnight blue that I think is really great. So you guys can check those out if you're looking for some slip dresses. I love a really great, easy slip dress. I mean, you just put that on throw on some sandals and you have a really great date night outfit. Maybe you're going out with your friends. You just wanna throw something comfortable on. I would totally wear this during the day as well. I mean, for me, an easy breezy slip dress, it doesn't matter. I just love that you can really transition dresses like this for different occasions. If it's your personality, I know for some people it might be a little bit too much for the day, but that's fine if it is. You can always just keep it for an evening dress, going out to dinner, things like that. But I just threw this dress on with a pair of sandals. These are my gold Fendi sandals here again. Perfect, and then I throw on that Fendi bag with the black pattern on it because I just love the way green and black looks. And then of course with the pop of gold, everything. I just love the way this looks. Comfortable to wear, very easy. You'll be cool, you'll be cute, good to go. So I'll link those slip dresses for you guys. Make sure you check them out. And if you pick them up, let me know how you love them because I'm always looking for really great dresses, especially to add to my collection because they're easy to wear, they look good, and they're very flattering. The way slip dresses skim the body, you cannot go wrong. They're classic silhouettes. They will never go out of style. So that is it, you guys. Those are all the outfits that I want to show you guys this week. Let me know, of course, which one is your favorite. I love to chat with you guys in the comments. Let me know if you're able to recreate any of these looks or if you already have any of these pieces because I style pieces that I have already. I mix the old with the new and I style things over and over again so you get to really see how you can make the most out of it. So some of you might already have these because I've shared them before. So let me know in the comments if you do and how you've been loving it. I would love to hear your feedback. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you guys wanna check me out on some of my other socials, I'll have my Instagram and Pinterest Pinterest linked in the description box. Thanks again for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Be sure to check out my ebook. You guys, I got such a positive response from so many of you and I thank you guys so much. I'm so happy you guys loved uh, my ebook where I share with you guys everything that I have done to get to the point that I'm at right now. I get so many questions about how to be successful on YouTube, what I did, you know, any tips that I have to offer and Literally everything is in that guide. And I got so much good feedback from you guys about how 
valuable you feel that this guide is and it truly is so now i'm really excited to say that you guys can get the audio version of this ebook i know a lot of you might be very busy but you still want to learn how to succeed on youtube you want some tips and some guidance and i know that a lot of people are just really busy maybe you're a mom maybe you are only able to listen while you're like on the computer at work so this audiobook is going to allow you to do that it's going to give you all the same information but now you can just listen and you don't have to sit in one place and read we're all very busy and I know we all are multitasking, but you still want to be able to get the information. So the audiobook is now live. You guys check the description box and pick it up. And I would love to know you guys' feedback. It helps so much in me just like, you know, being able to share more with you guys and just know that you're able to receive the information. So definitely check the description box. I'm really excited for this and I cannot wait for you guys to check it out as well. Oh.